out there in YouTube land and welcome back to another video from Devoted to Disney Down Under. Today I'm going to open another action figure for you guys. Now this is an older one. This might be like 2018, five years old. Um, but this is, I don't know how you guys say it out there, but I call him Zookus. I heard people call him Zuckus. I prefer Zookus. So I'm going to show you this one opened because I'm setting up my black series collection i have pulled down the masters of the universe collection setting up the black series so now i'm going to really get to opening these for you guys the ones that have been sitting there for years so i'm going to open this one and add it to the collection but first i'm going to open it for you guys so it is in the older style black series box um we don't see this style anymore i think i might have one here somewhere with a new style that's the new style there So this is a very old one, um, and it is a character that I really need for my Bounty Hunter collection. So there are six of them. We know the last one I need after this one is Four Loan. So I'm going to open this, guys. Come back and join me in a second. Okay, guys, got him out of the packaging now. And yes, he is quite impressive. He looks exactly like he does in The Empire Strikes Back. So I will be very happy to put him on the shelf next to the other i've only got four i still need four alone so next to the other four and if we all remember the little story from the vintage kenner line it actually says for this guy four loam on the packaging the names got mixed up on the card now i think they do pay tribute to that there is a, a con exclusive one of him with four loam instead of zucas so that is on a Empire this card. So anyway, back to the figure. The colouring of the um what'd you say? His gown or his Yeah, gown. Um is darker and more accurate to the film than the vintage toy, because remember it's very beigey in the actual Kenner line. So they've got back to the actual movie colors itself so closer to the new new uh um power of the force line so it looks good i'm gonna close up there on his little on his face and you see him for a few seconds guys but he's just he's, he is very iconic he's one of the six bounty hunters so just a quick look at the articulation because we all like to get some poses. It is double jointed at the knees, although we still have the pin. So it's an older style figure. Ankle rockers are nice and tight, so you can get some nice posing done there. He is at the waist, although you won't get much waist movement because of the clothing and the attire he's wearing, the belts and breathing apparatuses. Um, so there we have it, guys. Four loam in the black series. Now, you do get his blaster. Blaster is very much like the one we get in the vintage collection back in 1980. So, that is Zucus. I say Zucus. A lot of people say Zuckus. But I just always said it as that. So, I'm not going to change now. So, I'm happy to put him on the shelf, on my Empire Strikes back shelf. So, very happy. Now, I'm just going to chase down a four loam. Um, I've had him for a few years, guys, so I'm going to have some older ones to show you and, uh, as I put them up. I'll be opening them, so come back and have a look at them and get my thoughts. I'm happy with this guy. He's just a plain figure, but he looks exactly like he does in the movie, so I'm very happy. So come back and join me for some new videos, guys, um, and until next time, happy collecting and bye for now.